I was walking upstairs, and Bernie was up there mopping oh, yeah. in the hallway. <laughs> Bernie. And we, when yeah, we got to the top of the stairs, Bernie said, if you guys walk across that floor, you're going to find out why they call me Big Bad Bernie. <laughs> 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 so we immediately turned around and went back She didn't always say foot tall. Well, she wasn't on a Big Bad Bernie. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good golfer, though. Uh, cool. She's a big golfer, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Grandpa, I heard somebody ask you what you missed most about being out and about, and I did not hear your answer. What? What is it? Everything. <laughs> yeah. Just being out. Yeah. Thank you one of these days, I'm going to have to get a haircut, so I'll <laughs> give somebody to help me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Barber shop. Yeah. Well, Dave cuts, G chair G cuts days all the time. <laughs> Maybe you can hold up your pants to get in line. <laughs> <laughs> it's an excuse to get out, though. <laughs> Find a nice day. <laughs> well, I wouldn't mind having you try it. <laughs> Today was a very nice day. Did you know it, it was probably 50 degrees? Yeah, I see them. Mm -hmm. It was like that on our thermometer. Uh huh. Oh, yeah, the thermometer. Looks like a nice day. Yeah. Uh, for those of us who went on a walk, a lot of um, Don and Gene and Dave started out in big coats and then took their coats off. <laughs> yeah. That's always a pleasure, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. Take mm -hmm. cool off. Mm -hmm. Enjoy that weather. Mm -hmm. At the end of November, yes. <laughs> <laughs> in Laramie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you know, it doesn't happen very often, but we've even seen Dave went out pitching horseshoes without jackets mm. on Christmas Day. Oh, uh, right on. Wow. Paul and I out playing golf. New Year's Day, one time, <laughs> no jackets. <laughs> now that's pretty rare. Mm -hmm. On New Year's. Nice. We used to always have a luggage in the luggage driveway. So what time, when I called everybody, Nick said it's just too cold. You got to do it in the house. We did. Except when Seaman showed up with his cover on the He'd wear anything except he'd want to underwear. He'd underwear and he'd cover on it. He about died and I mean, he got to the house. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're going to pick this up. You have another puzzle. I think so. Stay till midnight or something. <laughs> <laughs> I guess probably go to bed a little earlier tonight. <laughs> Maybe they ought to wait till tomorrow. <laughs> that might be a better idea. <laughs> I think we need to admire it. I'm just curious. <laughs> I was feeling pretty tired before dinner. Huh. Yeah. Well, I'll be because I stayed up late last night. Mm -hmm. Why, hello, Grandpa. Hi. How are you doing? I'm doing really excellent. And I hear your health is taking a bit of a turn, so I wanted to call and ask if I could talk to you today. So I'm glad you made it to the phone. Yeah. I'm too. Good to hear from you. Yeah. Uh, Grandpa, I, uh, I was wondering, something that's very important to me is hearing people's voices. So, would it be okay if I recorded this call so I could listen to it in the future? Sure. That's fine. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Well, I have good news. I've been accepted into a college. Well, what college? Uh, 
at Barclay College in Haviland, Kansas. Oh, Kansas. Yeah. What town? Haviland. Haviland. Well, how about that? Yeah. All I can say is good for you. And good luck. Thank you very much. I don't know for certain that that's the college I will attend, but I'm thrilled I've been accepted to one. Well, good. That's good to hear. Yeah, yeah. And you're on your way. Yeah, amen, amen to that. Did Did you attend all of your all of your college years at uh, University of Wyoming? No, I didn't. I spent the first year. Junior College at Grand Junction, Colorado. In where, Colorado? Grand Junction. Oh, Grand Junction. Right on. Yeah. And then I finished up with graduate work at Oklahoma. A&L. Oh, really? What What does the A&L stand for in the Oklahoma school? A&M. Oh, A&M. Yeah, I get closer in mind. Oh, cool. There used to be several of them with that. There's not very many anymore. Yeah. Thanks to them still holding out, but most of them have become state universities. Okay, okay. Cool. Well, did, uh, I don't know if I've talked to you since this, but I've, I've been training and I jogged my first marathon recently. Well, getting ready for a, a triathlon, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, good. You're pretty eager. That sounds good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm having. Like yeah, I'm enjoy. I'm enjoying having having a goal to give me motivation to be working out and working hard and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I do. Yeah, and I have, I have. A few friends who who like to work out with me here. Yeah, yeah, it does. What would you would you mind telling me some of the some of the ways you spend your your time nowadays, Grandpa? I've heard from my mom that you're you're mostly having to stay at home. What sort of thoughts are coming to mind? Well, I don't do anything worthwhile. I'm not worth anything. But I work on crossword puzzles, jigsaw puzzles, mm-hmm. read books. Mm. That's about it. Yeah. <laughs> well, I hope you know to everybody you are, you are worthwhile and. Yeah. Oh, well. e- even if the only brain that you are working out is your own, that's that's still uh, that's still activity and vital. <laughs> well, trying to be to say that, but just that's the way I am. Well, like I said, good to hear from you. Good to hear from you. I talk. I hope good to luck talk. To you. Thank you. Thank you, Grandpa. I hope to talk to you again soon. All right. All right. All right. Bye. Bye, Kristen. Bye, bye, Grandma. Love you. Oh, you're still there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, we appreciate you calling. You can fill me in on what you told me. Okay. Thank you. Have a great day, Grandma. Love you. Thank you. We love you too. All right. Bye. Bye.